what's up my beautiful people welcome back to the channel if you're here welcome kindly hit that red subscribe button below for the returning subscribers we love you so much thank you for always coming back and as we already read the title of this video exactly you know who we are going to talk about today yeah and we are going to talk about mistruding there is a lot of things that have been going around with mistruding netizens coming for her here and there you know so just stay tuned watch this video till the end do not skip the video and let's get into the video Wodemaya and Miss Trudy have been dating for some years now and they even officiated their marriage by getting married, you know, in Kenya. And netizens have been admiring this couple. How do they manage their relationship as Miss Trudy is in Kenya and Wodemaya is in Ghana? We've seen that Miss Trudy have stayed in Kenya for a while right now. Yeah, and it has take long for her to go to Ghana you know and netizens have been asking themselves why is Miss Trudy not going to Ghana yet she is married there but Miss Trudy have not been answering these people but recently you saw how Wodemaya decided to flew his mom from Ghana to Kenya just to come and see Miss Trudy's dad just to come and see the daughter-in-law country how it looks like but the first country that Wodemaya's mom was wanting to visit was America but Wodemaya decided you know what mom let's first start by visiting our own country Kenya he wrote this on Instagram. It took me days to convince my mom to fly with me to Kenya. But believe me, this is the most emotional moment in my whole life. Especially when my mom said, I wish your dad was here. Look at this emotional message. Wadimaya's mom or rather Auntie Maggie wished that you know, at least Maya's dad, if he was alive, she could be flying with him and they could be seeing their son's success, you know. But what Maya, of course, decided to flee Auntie Maggie to Kenya so that she can come and visit Miss Trudy's dad so that they can meet. And this thing raised conversation among netizens. You know that Miss Trudy already got married. And these people got married before the parents meeting, you know. And this is what it has been raising concern about netizens. You know, why did these people decide to get married without their parents first meeting? That is what netizens have been asking themselves. I'll be taking a look at some of the comments on how or what they had to wrote and miss trudy's dad they had never or he had never meet with wadamaya's mom and this was the first time that they met you know this is a long distance relationship guys and it is not easy even miss trudy herself said traveling to ghana is the most expensive flight ticket that she always Pay. let us look at some of the netizens reaction on what they had to ask or you know to have a discussion why did these parents not meet first before the two people or rather what am I and Mr. Trudy getting married you know at Wangui she said finally met that means they have never met before yet you are both husband and wife Kwani, you got married without parents meeting how was the dowry paid or there was no dowry in the first place this is the question that wangui asked there is a fan here that wrote so you get married without them meeting where because this thing actually shocked netizens how could these people get married without their parents first meeting but you know guys it is understandable it is, it is understandable because it is a long distance relationship this is just the first attack that miss trudy is getting from netizens guys you've not listened other attacks or the cyber bullying that just miss trudy have been undergoing on social media you know she was just or she is just experiencing a hell in social media because of high rate 
of cyberbullying. You know, people writing nasty stuff, people writing different stuff. Mm -hmm. Of course, she has done collaborations with Wodemaya's mom. Many videos she has featured Auntie Maggie on some videos. And there is a video, you know, that Wodemaya's mom was teaching Miss Trudy how to make this fufu. Uh, she wrote, my Ghanaian mother-in-law teaches me how to make Ghana fufu. Ghana food in Kenya in brackets fufu and light pepper soup. This was so fun. Watch full video on my YouTube channel. She did the video like a week ago. You know, if you haven't checked the video, kindly go and check the video. It was so nice, you know. But netizens here they also came for Miss Trudy. You know that she is disrespecting what the Maya's mom. Why is she calling? her mother-in-law or rather she should just call him mom like bukon bukon lao said trudy please stop this discrimination attitude of yours addressing your mother-in-law as Ghanaian mother-in-law please learn to see her as your own biological mom and stop addressing her as mother-in-law please guys i want us to drop our comments down below do you think that it is bad for miss trudy to address what a mom as mm -hmm. mother-in-law please drop your comments down below at nyax underscore joke said mother-in-law that's enough it sounds so awkward every time you add Ghanaian, like it's a special case but njoki nyax njoki of course miss trudy's or whatever's mom is a special person to miss trudy and she loves ghana that's why she can't miss it to say my ghanian but guys i want us to have the conversation down below will miss trudy be seen as a bad person calling on mom as mother-in-law you know you know this is an african culture and actually here in Kenya, most of the daughter-in-laws address their mother-in-laws as just mother. For those words of in-law, actually, they're not included. You know, it is. it shows some respect when you call your mother-in-law mother rather than mother-in-law. I want us to drop your comments down below. Let us have a conversation down below. Or am I just speaking some gossip or there is some truth in it? let us have a conversation down below on the comment section there is another thing that miss trudy have been attacked and this one came from kenyans you know miss trudy did of course collaborations with her mother-in-law and there is this video that miss trudy was searching for a Ghanaian food was it a cry and some eggshell you know and hey miss trudy was saying actually we don't have that in kenya it is just curse in kenya and actually netizens had to come for miss trudy that she should stop embarrassing us as kenyans people may see that we don't have uh, those foods here in kenya but we have a lot let's take a look at some of the comments at wazuri said i think you are very good with your content but it's important that if you don't know something don't mention it just do your research first tell the people or your followers you will update them when you have the correct answer you know when she was saying to the followers we don't have those food or it is scarce in the market at cut underscore wa underscore mutunga said my dear please always google before you say something it's really embarrassing how you keep making these mistakes we even export okra you know miss trudy was saying actually we don't have okra in kenya that is why you are saying netizens have come for her stop embarrassing us as kenyans this food we have them if you are not sure do not skip do not speak on camera or rather tell them or your followers or your subscribers you will research then you will come with an answer <laughs> what are your opinions guys please drop your comments down below on the comment section do you think that actually these people just written negative comments on miss trudy's social media it is just you know draining huh and if you like this video just give it a thumbs up consider giving it a thumbs up please don't forget to share your feedbacks or your opinions down here on the comment section on the view that you see on Miss Trudy do you think that just people they're using this thing of rating negative 
comments just writing for the sake of writing and it is affecting this person that have created this content because Miss Trudy's head it is just these comments they are just draining Miss Trudy's head what do you think guys please drop your comments down below in the comment section let us have a conversation and if you haven't subscribed to this channel kindly hit that red subscribe button below for the returning subscribers we love you so much thank you for always coming back see you in our next video peace